and struggling to go with them as top line Tommy, then Runas and Mithmar down to the final flight on the rail at Scala. Alongside is Grange Walk. There's precious little between them with 100 yards left to go. And it's nip and tuck. Scala on the rail from Grange Walk as they go toward the line. Scala by half a length to Grange Walk. Well clear of top line Tommy. And fourth was Runas. And struggling to go with them as top line Tommy, then Runas and Mithmar down to the final flight on the rail at Scala. Alongside is Grange Walk. There's precious little between them with 100 yards left to go. And it's nip and tuck. Scala on the rail from Grange Walk as they go toward the line. Scala by half a length to Grange Walk. Well clear of top line Tommy. And fourth was Runas. Straightening for the final flight in the follow Kilbegan on Instagram Mare's Hurdle. It's Jamie Summers and Koha Landers in front. With gone off in pursuit, Laura Bullion and Owen Wall Sheffernock Fizz. The Grey picking up well on the outside is Rescue Package. Jamie Summers is running out of his state and Rescue Package gets up for Tony and Danny Mullins. Jamie Summers second and then Laura Bullion, Effernock Fizz make my heart fly. Straightening for the final flight in the follow Kilbegan on Instagram Mare's Hurdle. It's Jamie Summers and Koha Landers in front. With gone off in pursuit, Laura Bullion and Owen Wall Sheffernock Fizz. The Grey picking up well on the outside is Rescue Package. Jamie Summers is running out of estate and Rescue Package gets up for Tony and Danny Mullins. Jamie Summers second and then Laura Bullion, Effernock Fizz make my heart fly. And Moonball is about to lose the lead to receive the top weight. Gone on a few lengths cleared of Mountain Fox and Zani and then name lock, but it's Racine and Paul Townend who've raced on away from Moonball and over the last it is Racine the top weight and Paul Townend pushed out to win the follow Kilbegan on Twitter handicap for trainer Edward O'Grady. Moonball second, third was in Zani, fourth Mountain Fox and fifth was name lock. And Moonball is about to lose the lead to receive the top weight. Gone on a few lengths cleared of Mountain Fox and Zani and then name lock, but it's Racine and Paul Townend who've raced on away from Moonball and over the last it is Racine the top weight and Paul Townend pushed out to win the follow Kilbegan on Twitter handicap for trainer Edward O'Grady. Moonball second, third was in Zani, fourth Mountain Fox and fifth was name lock. And they've slipped three lengths clear of Thousand Tears, Field de Mott, and Mr. Moon Dance has run out of puff as they come towards the final flight, and it's Bective Cave chased by Thousand Tears, Bective Cave over the last from Thousand Tears, then Field de Mott, Nashton Court, and up to the finish, an easy winner here, Bective Cave, a double in quick time for Paul Townend on board two top weights also, second is uh, Thousand Tears, and then Field de Mott, Nashton Court. And they've slipped three lengths clear of Thousand Tears, Field de Mott, and Mr. Moon Dance has run out of puff as they come towards the final flight, and it's Bective Cave chased by Thousand Tears, Bective Cave over the last from Thousand Tears, then Field de Mott, Nashton Court, and up to the finish. An easy winner here, Bective Cave, a double in quick time for Paul Townend on board two top weights also. Second is uh, Thousand Tears, and then Field de Mott, Nashton Court. On the outside is Bye Bye Oh Bye, reminders for Golden Nomad. Bit of a break then to Father Jed and it's Ocean Glandor to the final flight. Under Rachel Blackmore from the trigger and Sean Flanagan on the far side in a set two with 100 yards left to go. And it's the trigger on the far side getting the better of Ocean Glandor as the evening is turning into one for the old stagers. The trigger from Ocean Glandor by Bio by Golden Nomad. On the outside is by Bio by reminders for Golden Nomad. Bit of a break then to Father Jed and it's Ocean Glandor to the final flight. Under Rachel Blackmore from the trigger and Sean Flanagan on the far side in a set two with 100 yards left to go. And it's the trigger on the far side getting the better of Ocean Glandor as the evening is turning into one for the old stagers. The trigger from Ocean Glandor by Bio by Golden Nomad. A 
as Turbo has them spaced out over the final fence, a long way clear from Scully's dream, then April's joy, Reuben, James, and Blazer Trail. But this is a very easy winner indeed, Turbo and Kevin Sexton. What a day for the Sexton household, as Turbo has won by a big margin. Scully's Dream second, April's Joy third, as Turbo has them spaced out over the final fence, a long way clear from Scully's Dream, then April's Joy, Reuben, James and Blazer Trail. But this is a very easy winner indeed, Turbo and Kevin Sexton. What a day for the Sexton household as Turbo has won by a big margin. Scully's Dream second, April's Joy third. And then comes Mossy White and Humps and Bumps. And at the last, it's Ema over safely from Monchago. And then Rudy Catrail, followed by Mossy White and Humps and Bumps next. But up towards the finish, it's a worthy gold star here for Ema. And a chance ride for Brian Cooper. And good evening for Matthew Smith. Monchago second, third Rudy Catrail, Mossy White four, and five Humps and Bumps. And then comes Mossy White and Humps and Bumps, and at the last, it's Ema over safely from Monchago, and then Rudy Catrail, followed by Mossy White and Humps and Bumps next. But up towards the finish, it's a worthy gold star here for Ema, and a chance ride for Brian Cooper, and good evening for Matthew Smith. Monchago second, third Rudy Catrail, Mossy White four, and five Humps and Bumps.